do 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 with this to Greg! Hi boys and girls, today I'm going to show you something like this. How to draw it. This is a lot of fun. You can see this one has little Easter eggs, but this one has carrots. Some people uh, would rather draw carrots than Easter eggs. So it's your choice. I'm going to show you how to draw a carrot real quick. Because in the video, I don't have uh, anything about carrots. It's all about the Easter eggs. But to draw a carrot is fairly simple. You just take and draw a long V, sort of like this. It looks like the letter V, but it's sideways. And then you add a little curve on the end. Okay. And then you add in some lines. And then a little stem okay easy stuff drawing carrots you don't have to make them perfect now let's get to the video I'll show you how to draw this guy and then if you choose to add carrots instead of Easter eggs that's your choice okay let's get started first thing you want to do is draw in the nose the nose is somewhere in the middle of the paper after that, you're going to draw the letter J coming off of the nose. And then another J, but backwards beside it. After that, you can decide if you want to put on a tongue or little teeth. For teeth, you draw sort of like a square type line. And for a tongue, you draw more like a U-shaped line. For the eyes, you can decide what kind you want. This has little reflections in it and eyelashes. I'm going to make this one a little different. <laughs> He's cute. Now, as far as his head goes, it is a long oval. So slow down and try to connect with that line. Bunnies have big ears. This rabbit has a big ear like that. And then we'll put another line inside of it. And on the other side, we'll do the same thing. Try to make them about the same size, same height, same width, and then put a little one inside. Now mine aren't perfect. Yours probably won't be perfect either. That's okay. Now as far as his body goes, you're gonna just put a little oval shape that's cut off because his head's in the way. And then we'll put on his little feet. <laughs> and make sure you put on both of them. And then he has a little cotton bumpy kind of tail down there and then I'm gonna put in this kind of a line for his arm and this kind of a line for his arm it sort of looks like the letter C and a backwards C just like that was a J and a backwards J now we'll put in his little fingers and his little toes starting to look like a bunny pretty good so far now a big egg he's holding an egg so we're gonna put kind of a sad face line there and then we'll come down not drawing through his hand but coming down past his hand we'll finish the egg off Oh, that looks cute. Now, you'll have to decide if you want to decorate your egg. Some people will put polka dots like this one. Some people will put wiggly lines or stripes. You can decide how you want yours to be. Don't put in too many details because we'll be coloring these and it'll be hard to color if you put in too many details. Uh, you know, too much detail. All right, now, as far as this line goes, that's where the ground and the uh, 
the sky meets. So the sky will come the whole way down and the ground will be here. If you want to put a egg that's standing up over here like I did, you can or you can put your eggs in different places. Now this line, just like the egg line went behind the hand, we're going to put this line behind the egg. And then you can draw in as many eggs as your paper can fit. And if you only want a couple, that's fine. Some people might only, you know, put one or two. So he has one, two, three eggs. This one has one, two, three, four, five eggs. You can choose how you want to do yours. Again, there's lots of uh, ways that you can make yours different than mine. I added eyelashes. Uh, maybe even little eyebrows might be a cool idea. Aw, cute. Now, if you want to uh, uh, do teeth, you'll need to draw one last line between his teeth. Oh, <laughs> so cute. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to color it in, and you guys will color yours too. I hope you had fun, and I'll see you on the next video.